Hello, you're very welcome to Jerry's DIY. Today we're going to fix a blocked wash-on basin in a bathroom. Very, very easy. It's going to take less than 30, 40 seconds to fix. I'm not going to use one of these. These have been used many times on this before. I can't use chemicals here because it's got a water treatment plant you know, outside and you can't put chemicals into it. So we're not going to use these. I could use these, but we're not going to. We're going to use an Aquavac, you know, just a shop vac, wet and dry vacuum cleaner. And it's going to empty this and probably fix it permanently. Here we go. So on the other camera, you'll see that the wash on basin is actually blocked. We've got about half a bowl of water in it. It's not going anywhere. It'll take ages, maybe an hour to kind of drain away. So what I'm going to do is I have a shop vac. Um, one of these things, you know, this is old. And um, you know, if you have one to hand, it's very handy for fixing these. What happens is when, you know, obstructions, hair, whatever, goes down beyond the grate in, in, the, in the bowl, in the sink, when it goes down beyond that, it gets stuck in the trap. You know, the trap will be a U-bend of sorts. But what happens is you get long hairs or whatever hanging, and they just grab all the stuff going down. And uh, you know, you use your plunger, you push some of the big stuff, but you don't stop the hair. So this is really easy to do. We've got a wet and dry vacuum cleaner. Doesn't mind sucking water. Don't do this with your good vacuum cleaner. <laughs> okay, so before we get going on this, all of these wash hand basins have an overflow. Okay, the overflow will allow the air from the vacuum cleaner, the negative pressure, to be fed from that hole. So what you want to do is block that hole and put the, the nozzle over the outlet. Here we go. So just to show you that this did actually work. The water's going down as fast as I put it in. And if I fill the sink, if I fill the washout basin, or half fill it, okay, pull the stopper out. There you go, it's a far cry from what it was a few minutes ago. So that's it, just a simple one minute fix. You know, it takes longer to set this whole thing up, getting your vacuum cleaner in, in my case, getting a camera or two in here as well. So easy fix. So if you like the video, please thumbs up, subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks, bye for now, good luck.